Hi guys, I'm really so happy to share this video with you. Welcome to Albibati Tech Channel and sorry for my English. In fact, I'm not a native English speaker, uh, as you know. And so just sorry if I miss some word or uh, say something not in the correct way. But today I'm going to show you my scientific, graphic and uh, even programmable uh, calculator collection. In fact, uh, we start from this one. That is my first scientific calculator at all, the TI-30X Second B. As you can see, it's a normal scientific calculator with uh, sin, cos, tangent, uh, and all the other. I don't know if in English uh, this is the correct way to say that uh, mathematical function, but uh, I don't know. This is not uh, the problem. As you can see, the first is it, it's going to be a, a little review of all these uh, um, model and type of calculator, uh, Texas Instruments and Casio. For example, this one, the TI 30X Second B, uh, have the first display that is a, a, a pixel display for example as you can see like this while the other one uh, just uh, in this position the, this other display is not um, a pixel display but only uh, for example the, the display of the elevator so uh, it can show only numbers okay now I say it right it can show only numbers while this one can show only letter and uh, everything you, you want to put inside this calculator but it's not the most uh, uh, it's my first one and I lost this one one time on the bus but I just uh, immediately buy another one identical one because for my secondary school uh, it was so useful this one but now let's go to this other one, this TI-30XB. This is just a um, scientific but more um, complex, but not complex, also useful calculator because it has a natural display. Uh, natural display is for Casio 1, uh, for a TI is multi-view display. In fact, you can see that I um, view uh, on the display the function just in a natural way. For example, this, uh, this sign I can just uh, show as I write on my notebook, for example. In fact, uh, we can see that uh, uh, another important function that have this model and not the Casio one is that if I write another um, equation, for example, okay, 2 plus square 3 fract uh, 5, for example, okay, we have this result uh, and uh, even uh, we can just uh, go from the, all the result we just calculate in the past, uh, even if we turn off the calculator, just moving with this uh, uh, arrow. So just arrow up and arrow down, we can show in, uh, in a continuous way, yes, this is the difference between this one and the Casio one, in a continuous way we can show um, all the uh, previous uh, numerical equation and the results. Other things, uh, we can write the equation with an X symbol, for example, um, like this cos X fract 5 plus 2 X ok and the x is the previous uh, value we can just memorize into this variable but now let's go to this one that is my second um, scientific calculator and my first graphic calculator one now we uh, this is not on the market anymore and it is the ti 82 stats now the ti starts from the 83 uh, above for example this is a uh, I like this one a scientific but even a graphic calculator the things uh, is that in the normal way for example we don't have the natural display so for example we have to write 2 plus bracket uh, 5 uh, divide by 6 for example equal to and we can see that we have a continuous display like the in the TI 30XB but here we don't have the natural display one but we have the graphic function for example here we can just go into the equation mode so we can write all the equation we want and uh, Yes, the uh, maximum 10, 10 equation, and we can just plot this equation. For example, if I uh, just press graph button, now I can, I can see the two equation I previously wrote, so these two, in the, in this graphic mode. We can even adjust zoom, for example, if we go to zoom fit, for example, now the calculator just elaborates my, my input, and in a moment, it will display just the zoom uh, the calculator retain uh, in the optimal way for just showing these uh, uh, two equations. In fact, uh, we can now see uh, this equation. It's just very useful, for example, to see the how a function just evolve in the in the space. Uh, let me say this in a just quick way. For example, 
for this is very useful. And we've got also the stats function. Uh, in fact, it is a, a TI-82 stats. So for example, if we go in stats, uh, we have all the stats function, as you can see. Okay. Other things about this one is that uh, I just ordered this from France uh, and it's not new but is a used model and I just bought it and ordered from France. It's because of the green color, yes I know, because the, the, I just like the, the combination between green and blue color. In fact, on the back is a blue and you can see that uh, in front is uh, green, blue and white and so I just like uh, these things uh, and together with the multi-view display uh, so just the natural display uh, it's a very useful scientific uh, Texas Instruments calculator now just go to the big one the TI Inspire 6 CAS so this is a graphic model the diamond of the Texas Instruments uh, calculator uh, in fact uh, it's just uh, it has a full color LCD display we can just do whatever we want, uh, even graphic uh, uh, function, even th three dimension graphics. Uh, we can have a spreadsheet, uh, we can have uh, uh, tables, we can have uh, just a geometry function, uh, a lot of things. And this is the famous one on, uh, on which I install Pokemon Emerald. In fact, if I go to documents, for example, okay, just a few seconds and I can show you. Now I go to endless, endless installer, just wait a few moment. Okay, now I'm going to install Endless with the menu button. As you can see, just wait a few seconds. Okay, now you can see it just in uh, green, the, um, this, uh, this phrase, Endless installed. And uh, it's always show here that uh, Endless is installed on your calculator. So you have to go on Documents. Now, not on Endless, but on GBA, my GBA folder. Now, in the GPSP Lancer. Okay, just wait a few seconds. Okay, and we can see that here we have all the um, Game Boy Advance uh, games that we have installed on this calculator. So Sonic Advance, just two, for example, I can put even Zelda, even all the Game Boy Advance games are supported. Not the Nintendo DS game because the Nintendo DS have two screens. One of them is a touch screen, so it's not uh, uh, possible to install on this calculator without a second screen and a touch screen. So just press on Pokemon Emerald. Wait a few seconds, and now you can see your Pokemon Emerald game just start in a full. Uh, it uh, used the full resolution of the screen, and it's uh, even uh, useful. And uh, the the feeling of using this game is just uh, similar of a Game Boy Advance. So you can see just now the start of the Pokemon Emerald. We can even skip these things. Okay, so you can see Pokemon. Emerald version, skip again, press start, new game, and here we have the Professor Oak just telling us what to do in the in the in the Pokemon Emerald game, so we can just go on. But I just show these things and and how to install um, Pokemon uh, Emerald version and the other uh, Game Boy Advance games on TI Inspire Six uh, on a previous video. I'm gonna if I have time because I have got not I've got no time in this period of my life. If I have time, I'm gonna show you in detail in details how to um, download all the files you need and from which sites you can download all the um, files you need just. To, to do these things on your calculator. But now just go back and so just go, go there and you can see all your thing. We're gonna press exit GPSP. Okay, and now we are back. This so is a calculator we, with you can do um, a lot of very lot of things and it's the cast version so you can even connect this to your laptop and just uh, program for this calculator on your laptop or uh, program uh, on the calculator and just transfer the program to your laptop or, P or uh, PC or Mac. You can just use with ever uh, operating system Mac or uh, Mac OS or Windows. So now just go to this other calculator. This is at this point of the video my creepy camera. No, I'm joking. It's a good one. Stop recording. I don't know why. And so I'm gonna re-record it. But this is the occasion to describe better the calculator uh, I um, show you. So the Casio FX 570 ES Plus. In fact, 
uh, I told you that is a natural VPAM, so a natural display, uh, as the TI 30XB, um, Texas Instrument 30XB. And so, for example, uh, and another things that I love for of this Casio and even the TI calculator, only the TI 30XB, is that the divide button, the graphical display divide button, is in uh, this first function. So, for example, if I have to write um, cos 32, it's in the he, uh, the calculator is in degree mode, so uh, 32 is in degree, plus 5, uh, divide by, um, I don't know, 6 uh, square 2, for example, equal, and now I have the result. In this calculator, I have to use this arrow just to move between results, and I mm, can show, and uh, this calculator can show you only one result per time. But now I take the occasion just to... Um, ah, this calculator can solve even the uh, in, um, linear equation, so with the x, and so I'm gonna show you the same equation and then the time of response of this free model of calculator with the same equation. I'm gonna use the Chessy-Strickler e equation for the um, calculation of the height of a channel, so it's the project of a channel, and so with this uh, um, calculator uh, I'm gonna calculate the V8 of the channel. Okay, now I'm gonna write this Chessy Strickler formula for the project of a V8 of a channel, of a water channel. Okay, so now I'm gonna write this Chessy Strickler formula on my uh, Casio FX 570 ES Plus. I have already write in this calculator. In fact, uh, now then I'm gonna just press equal at the same time of uh, mm, all the free calculators. But now write uh, 60 times brackets 6 times alpha x now 6 plus 2 times again alpha x bracket close and the power of 2 divided by 3 times 6 times again x time square 0 0.002 minus 28 and now this equal to 0. I just discovered that the calculator is more efficient and quickly if we put all the terms at the left of the 0 for example. Okay now this is the equation okay so I have to press shift solve of this on these two and uh, graph on the other one so shift solve start for x 0 and again shift uh, solve start from x zero okay so three two one and go okay just wait this is the first one with the result so left minus right and this is 1.662 is the result of this equation so it's the eight of this equation the same one for this i just show you that the results are the same but this is more faster in fact in a few minutes i'm gonna describe this fx991 e X calculator but the result is the same even the display here is more uh, uh, defined but um, in a few minutes I'll describe even this calculator for this one I have the graph of the function uh, in particular I, ca I can even zoom for example now I press zoom zoom fit that is the zero button with the zoom fit we can see just the calculator graphing the function Okay, just return to a standard zoom, so number 6. Okay, so now we are turned to standard zoom, so just press calc. For example, the zero of the function, left bound zero is okay, right bound, for example, 10, okay. Now the calculator is calculating, and the calculator calcs the zero that is the same as all the other calculator. In fact, 1.662, 1.662, and again, this one... 1.662. So this is two different methods to use all this kind of calculator. But now I'm gonna show you the last one that is the Casio FX991EX class width.
Ok, so this one has a more defined uh, natural display, uh, a more fast, a faster pro processor inside. In fact, uh, we can solve the equation in just less time than the previous uh, FX 570 ES Plus, and a lot of other functions. For example, uh, we have uh, um, all, uh, in the menu all these features, for example, and uh, the, how can I say, the more efficient and the one for which you buy this calculator is even the spreadsheet. In fact, if you press this button you have a, a spreadsheet like for example in Microsoft Excel in which you can just um, just write numbers uh, and uh, even a formula and equation in fact if you just press option you can just fill formula and so like in Excel you can just write your formula inside here and uh, apply to all your spreadsheet okay now we turn in math mode okay perfect so uh, definitely this is my uh, calculator collection and uh, I have in program to buy another Casio, the FX uh, CG50 uh, that is uh, uh, a sort of uh, uh, this version but with the uh, display like the TI Inspire, so the big color display uh, and the CZ50 have also the same operating system as the previous Casio uh, CZ10 and 20. This uh, uh, is going to be my next uh, calculator I'm, I'm gonna buy. Uh, Again, uh, sorry for my English, but uh, I'm Italian and in Italian it's difficult to uh, speak English uh, just uh, every day is not uh, in our country and this is a big problem. Uh, it's not a thing that you can do easily uh, for, an Italian, uh, for Italian people. But uh, apart from that, uh, I hope you enjoy this video and see you again in the next video. So from Alibati Tech Channel, that's all. Bye bye.